What is going on guys? Back again. Uh, this is going to be the Cut Autograph Hall of Fame Mail Day. I'm going to turn you around so I can get a better look at them um, and uh, go from there. And I got one kind of a pet peeve on one of them. I don't know. You'll see. Alright, so the first one, this guy sent me uh, uh, extras also. And I think I'm now... Put the card down. Cornering the market on the Jace Peterson Bowman first Bowman cards. So, um, Saul, those are probably coming to you <laughs> because I don't have any use for uh, for Jace Peterson and Brad Bergenson, Bergeson rookie card. That's a Oriole, so that'll go in the the uh, Wesker Griff pile. But the first one, I didn't have. Uh, an autograph of him, Mr. Robin Roberts, numbered 4 of 49. This is from 2012 Prime Cuts, and everybody knows my favorite set, or mostly everybody does. This Prime Cuts, specifically 0405 uh, Prime Cuts, but I like most of the Prime Cuts. So that's a nice old Robin Roberts on the Hall of Fame postcard, uh, plaque postcard. Nice looking signature. This one, I did have an autograph of this guy, but I wanted this one anyways because it's from Prime Cuts 05. Uh, these next four are, yeah, next four are all from Prime Cuts 05. So I wanted this one. The other one I may put up for trade or sale, we'll see. But this one's so sick. Mr. Jesse Haynes, St. Louis Cardinals, 1920-1937, Hall of Fame, July 27, 1970. I mean, that's just ridiculous. So much there. Number 48 of 50. And this is just a beautiful design. I love that brown, old, antique look. Um, and the blue foil. So cool. They did different foil for the different... Like, here it says Hall of Fame signature. They did different foil for the different uh, signature types. This one also is a blue foil. Did not have one of him. Don't worry, these are all going to mags anyways. Um, Mr. George L. Kelly. Nice old uh, index card signature there, number 33 of 50. This one's also the blue because it's a Hall of Fame. Did not have that one. Did not have this guy. This is like the goldish foil. And it's the star signature, but Mr. Rube Marquard. Marquard? It's hard to say that. Is in the uh, Hall of Fame, but this is just the set that was put out. Now, this is number 20 of 37. Got a great deal on this. He's a New York Giants pitcher. Um, I did not pay anywhere near that. <laughs> For show. And now this one is my pet peeve uh, source of anger. There's a Carl Hubble cut autograph in there. And this is all packing tape. All the way around. So... Let's see if we can where's my knife cut this out I think this is ridiculous like what how I mean this much tape first of all it's a waste second of all it's garbage tape third you're making me risk either cutting myself or if I wasn't careful enough I'd be cutting through the top loader or if the card slips out the top I mean on all accounts, this is stupid. Without without uh, thinking about the person receiving the card. I mean... <laughs> oh, and then let's go ahead and throw some random tape on the back of it too. Number 17 of 50. Mr. Carl... Hubbard. This is a, a canceled check. Sorry. It was glaring. But there's the blue again, the Hall of Fame signatures. But I didn't have that. Got it for like 35 bucks or something like that or whatever. 37 something. Thought it was a great deal. Hopped on it because again, it's from my favorite set. So I'd say four out of five of those I didn't have. And to me, the Jesse Haynes is an upgrade. So we'll see. I can't believe I was able to snag these, and it was a good deal. Let's put it that way. 
So hope y'all have a good day. Keep an eye out for the next one. It's going to be the PSA reveal and uh, see what those grades are. All right. See ya.